Welcome back guys. Today's topic is about octal multiplication. So I'm gonna discuss how to multiply two octal numbers. So before going to multiplication, can you click that subscribe button so that we can get connected and I will answer your doubts within 24 hours if you comment down below. So let's go into multiplication without any further delay. So I'm going to take this example 2763.5 into 6 in octal form. So we are going to multiply 6 with 5 in normal decimal form. Then whatever result product we get that's going to be converted into octal. So let's multiply 6 into 5 that's 30. So 30 we need to convert into octal. So uh, I would suggest you write C and S so that it would be better for you because it's better to go in a step procedure rather than going in a hurry manner so write c and s so now convert into octal 8 into so 30 no 8 3 is a 24 plus 6 so some we are going to write over here so carry will be added with the next product so next product is 6 plus 6 into 3 which is 18 so 18 plus 3 is what? It's 21. Okay, 21 is 8 into 2 plus 5. So sum will be written over here and 2 will be added again. So now let's add 2 with the product. 6 into 6 it's 36. So 36 plus 2 is 38. So 8 into 4. So 32 plus is 6. So 6 is the sum and 4 is the carry. So now 6 into 7 that is 42 plus 6. So 42 plus 4 sorry. So 42 plus 4 that is 46. So now 8 into 5 plus 6. How many 6s man? I don't know. So one more 6 over here. So now 6 into 2 it's 12 plus carry. 12 plus 5 is over here that's 8 into 2 16 plus 1 so you got the result now it's carries there to write it over here 216656 six, six. so don't forget this dot if you forget this dot the entire result is wrong so this is your answer this is a simple approach you know it's better to write carry and sum because it gives you an inside and a better procedure you can go in this manner because you will not get an error if you go in this manner I hope you like this one so I'm gonna give you one more example where octal addition is required in this octal multiplication let's go this example is important so this is another example but here we will use octal addition don't forget octal addition is required for octal multiplication if you don't know how to add two octal numbers please go check out my octal addition video so let's add so let's multiply this so first multiply in decimal and then convert into octal so 5 to 0 it's 10 so 10 can be represented in octal so don't forget carry and sum which will be helpful for you if you don't want to make mistakes 8 1 0 1 so carry is 1 and sum is 2 okay so sum is 2 over here so carry is 1 which will be added for the next product 5 to 0 10 plus 1 it's 11 so convert 11 into octal so 8 into 1 plus 3 so carry, carry will be added for the next so write the sum over here so it's 3 and 2 now it's 5 into 3 15 plus 1 it's 16 so 8 into 2 plus 0 okay so you got 0 over here since no other bit is there so 2032 is the result for 5 now we need to multiply it by 3 so since it's 10th place it will be 0 over here so 3 into 2 it's 6 3 into 2 it's 6 we are writing it directly because we can represent 0 to 7 in octal okay not more than 0 to 7 don't forget that so 3 into 3 9 so again 9 we need to represent in octal so 8 into 1 plus 1 okay so it's represented as 1 and 1 since nothing is there 1 comes over here now we need to add that you need to add it you know it's 2 plus 0 it's 2 6 plus 3 it's not 9 don't write 9 here your answer will be wrong I want you to write an octal form so 9 is not in 0 to 7 so convert it into octal 
it's one and one so one over here one is carried over here so six plus one it's seven so two plus one it's three and one three seven two one is your answer so I hope you get that important point convert whatever you multiply into octal then after you need to add this in octal addition don't forget that this is not decimal addition we you need to add it in octal addition don't forget you will lose marks okay don't forget this two steps in error free method okay thanks for watching um, if you like this video and if it's valuable for you please subscribe and if you have any doubts regarding any other topics please comment down below i will answer as soon as possible and give you a better insight over the topic thanks for watching please do subscribe